<laughs> Dan's volcanic fortress. So, we're walking up to his fortress that's inside of the volcano. He sets up a trap door. You'd imagine that it would just be a pool of... Ow, God. Well, that looks like it hurt. What does that look like if I have, like, a regular rogue weapon on me? Okay. Hey, wake up. Five more minutes, Mom. <laughs> wake up. No need to poke me with your staff. Ow, my head. Where are we? Welcome to my home. Thank you for bringing Warlick all this way for me. Alright, we're gonna re-equip that weapon before I forget that I have a fire weapon. I was just... It just looked weird while I was laying down. I assumed that you would eventually try to sneak in and take the Pyronomicon from me. I told you it was a bad... Hey, what? <laughs> Quiet, you're going to make me lose my place. Now you've only... Now I've prepared my revenge for both of you for... Oh, my... I've prepared my revenge on both of you for some time. Now that I am more powerful than a hundred warlicks. <laughs> if you say so, man. The, the time is... Your humiliating defeat has arrived at last. Crackle, crackle. Zan, with all that new power, have you found a way to free Jania? Dude, dude, that is uh, not the right... Oh, wait. For some reason, I thought my guy was saying, I was going to be like, that is not the right move. Do not speak her name. It's your fault that she's imprisoned in that crystal. It's your fault that I look like this. If you had been able to control your magic during our duel, you just want to be the one to set her free so that she will love you instead of me. I love her more than you ever did. Even with the power of the Pyronomicon, I haven't been able to open the shard. But I'm close. So close. Once I'm done with you, I can focus all my energy on freeing Jania. And when she emerges, and you're already dead, she will thank me and love me forever. Ha ha ha. Zan, it was our combined unleashed magic that trapped her. If we work together, use our powers together again, then maybe. No more tricks, Warlick. You've reached the end of the ro your rope. However, you, Hunter. I can't deny your power. I would be a fool to let this go to waste. I have a proposal. Kill Warlick, kill him, and I'll release you. And share the power of the Pyronomicon with you. Kill the Blue Mage while I watch. Why would you... Okay, everything I know about Zan makes this seem out of character. What do you say? <laughs> um, this is probably a troll thing again. I want to see what happens. The end. The battle with Warlick is devastating and shakes the very mountain under you, under which you fight. But in the end, Warlick falls. What? <laughs> Zan keeps his promise. He shares the power of the Pyronomicon with you, and the two of you march forward at the head of Sepulchre's army, burning down everything in your path. Until one day when Zan finally thinks that he found a way to fr free the imprisoned Jania, all he needs is the rest of the power that he's sharing with you. He uses your bodies and body. He uses your body energy to fuel the sp his spell of release. The last thing that you hear is Zan screaming at his failure to free her again. Then blackness. <laughs> I love these. These are awesome. <laughs> no way, Warlick is my friend. No way, you lunatic. You want Warlick, you're gonna have to go through me. Actually, I'm okay with that. Welcome to my own personal battle arena, where there is one simple rule. Whoever lives goes free. Ha ha ha. You two will be fighting for your lives against hand-picked monsters from my army. Prepare yourself, fools. The battle is about to begin. Did he just say the same thing? I thought it looped. Oh no. Lava globs with almost 98 health. Whatever am I gonna do? That was probably a bit excessive now that I think about it. Well, sports fans, it looks like the lava globs never stood a chance. Let's see who's next. 
Oh, it likes it lets me heal between every battle. Inferno elementals. Um before I do the usual thing where I throw my weapons at them and instead of defensing it, I'm just gonna Yeah, that was awesome. I thought I was going to attack Warlick for a second. Ooh, snap! Get him! Oh. Well, I'm going to kill this one. Warlick can have that one. The, infer the Inferno Elementals, but little put up a little bit more of a fight, but still no match for Warlick and Hunter. I imagine, what, Basalt is next? Oh, you're not Basalt! <laughs> Although you're, um, never mind, you just looked way more intimidating than you appear to be. Other than you know, your stats lead me to believe. Um... Um, let's use Zap here. Oh, that was snazzy. I like that animation. Alright, Sun Warrior. Nice. Oh no, Warlick, kill the other one. I'm gonna do something real quick. Just because I think that might be coming up soon. The Sun Warriors have fallen, but it looks like the heroes are starting to get tired. Ha ha ha. Well, I probably would be if you would quit letting me heal before every fight. He got affected by Frozen anyway. Uh, we'll hit him with Blind first. Let's see what that does. Ooh, 103. Ouch. <laughs> that was a much better um, result of trying to debuff him. That's even better. Alrighty. The fan favorite Basalt has been defeated. Only one fight remains and both heroes are still standing. Now for the main event. The fight that you've all been- you I, what? I already said I'm not doing that. What? Zan, you said. What I said was whoever lives goes free. I intend to keep my word, but secretly I'm rooting for you. Go, Hunter, go. We don't have a cho- what? Dude! What are you talking about? You can always choose not to fight. Always. Yes, but one of us has to live. Zan is too strong for us to, with the Pyronomicon. If I win, he's sure to kill me anyway. If you live, he might let you go. You're going to have to defeat me. No! I know you want to do what is right, but this is our only choice. And if I really have to fight you, just... Just get to... What? And if I really do have to fight you just to get you to defend yourself, okay, I was confused for some reason, then I'll do it. I won't hold back either, so you better not. Um, somehow I don't think you're telling the truth. I'm just gonna throw this out there. <laughs> Alright, he resists ice and energy both, so I want to switch my weapon back to fire. Hold on a second. Okay. It was Shrink that I thought it had, I thought Immobility was the one that he had a 100% resistance to. He also has less HP than me. This shouldn't be that bad unless he just smacks me with, you know, a 103 critical hit. Oh. Yeah, something like that. <laughs> oh, and he dodged my... Ow. And thus the turntables. 
Ow, ow. We're gonna use smoke before I get killed. That wasn't as bad. Um, ha! You got stuck. Take that, Warlick. I am very tentatively willing to believe I've won this. Who, Doctor? That was close. You did it. You got rid of Warlick. Oh, Hunter, you've made the ha me the happiest mage on lore. Wait, what? What's happening to Warlick's body? An illusion? The Warlick you fought was an illusion? That's right. Push. Oof. Quick, Hunter, you have to defeat Zan. I think I can cut the power of the Pyronomicon off from him. I have to keep chanting this spell to contain the Pyronomicon's power. It's up to you. Warlick, you could have told me you had a plan. Can we talk about this later, please? I need to focus. <laughs> yeah, sure, sorry. I'm gonna switch my weapon back before I heal him. <laughs> Seriously, though, he's such a troll. It's hilarious. Okay, Zan, now it's just you and me. I think I need the Pyronomicon to kill you. My magic skills are more than a match for you, even without the book. Once I defeat your friend, I'm coming for you, Warlick. Do you hear me? Ha ha ha. Battle Zan. Let's see, as long as he did. You only resist immobility by 12. Huh. That's nice. It's a nice touch that darkness is as equally unaffected against him as fire is. So I'm gonna use smoke in my next turn. Yes, I am. All right. Give me them defense points. Not quite rolling. Um, that was weird. I heard a real weird sound just now. It sounded like the game like stopped, but it didn't look like the game stopped. Whew! All right. Pulling ahead here. Okay. He does not look like he intends on making that the lead I have for long. Why is everything getting stuck? Unstick. There we go. I love his defeated animation where the flame is gone. Simply amazing, what a battle. Ha ha ha. You think you've defeated me? You think you've broken my power? Ha ha ha. This isn't over. I'll destroy both of you. Or I'll destroy you, both of you. Ha ha ha. Did he just Zan, did he is he it looked like he did he just do the Terminator thing? I don't think so. But but you beat him, and we've got the Pyronomicon. It's too powerful to destroy, but it's too dangerous to keep in my tower. I think I know the right place to keep it hidden. And who knows, maybe Zan was right. Maybe it is powerful enough to free Junia. The important thing is that it is out of the hands of that madman. I can't believe that you were strong enough to defeat Zan on your own. You saved Limcrest, my friend, and you saved me. Thank you. I am forever in your debt. No problem. You've defeated the insane pyromancer Zan, and the powerful tome called the Pyronomicon is safe in Warlick's hands. But was that the end of Zan? Could his mastery over fire protect him from lava? Only time will tell. Um, slight spoilers here, but it is not the end of Zan. <laughs> he shows up several times after this 
He is a recurring villain, and he is great. Still doing that thing, huh? We'll go talk to Warwick again, though, because it looks like there- I believe there was an epilogue quest in a shop? Crazy illusion of Warwick. Um, other quests. Limcrest. Uh, reward shop, real quick. Sanity's Edge. Fever Blade. Just the thought of touching these makes you break into a cold sweat. Slow burn. The... Oh, the roses, that's actually a really nice touch. Retribution Blade, Fire Gem Daggers. That looks cool. The Lunatic Shard. I can't wield any of those yet. But I might come back for them. Anyway, one more. The end, question mark. We've got a big problem. When Zam was knocked into the lava, the remaining magic of the Pyronomicon bound to it. Zan and his lava titan form has erupted in... From the side of the mountain, he's lost control of himself. In this form, his magic is more like madness and there is nothing I can do to control it. Zan has become a lava beast. And he will be imp if it and he will be impossible to stop until he burns himself out, but with, f with magic fire, that may never happen. Limcrest, Falcon Reach, and every town for miles is doomed unless, yes, a dragon lord might be able to stop Zan. Do you think that you have the power to stop Zan? Stop Zan. Oh, this is cool. I like when they do these cinematic type videos. Oh my. Oh, seriously? It's making me... Well, why does Basalt suddenly have... Whatever. Okay, using Smash on him is probably unnecessary. We'll just use the, uh... It's our least expensive move. We use Rend. Yeah, we'll just Rend up to him. Whew. See, usually they just throw you right into the thick of the titan fight. Although it might be kind of cathartic to just take these things out after they probably hassled you so much during that quest, the entirety of the quest line up until now. Hello, Zan. I was hoping it would have let me uh, get the little heal thing. Alright, it says he resists mobility, but I might as well give it a whirl anyway. What else does it say? Resist ice and water. Here he's weak to it. Give him the breath a couple times. So if I lose th this, or if I lose this time, I think I'll try one more time with all my moves recharged, or with my mana recharged and stuff, and if I don't succeed that time, then um, I will just call it good. I think I'll be able to do this though, it doesn't look like... Oh wow, I am running out of mana though. It doesn't look too hopeless though. I am barely ahead. Get him with a stun. I should be able to manage.
Yeah, we got this. Barring some kind of massive, massive critical hit. Ta-da! Well done, Dragon Lord. Lava's Titan Zan has been defeated, and once more, you and your dragon have saved countless, countless lives. Somewhere is in that gigantic mass of lava and madness was the real Zan. Has he been defeated once and for all? Jania's blade. This dagger burns with an eldritch light for lost love. Ooh. Alright, that sounds cool. What's it look like? 31. I like the uh, bit down at the pommel there. It's nice. So I guess we'll head back to Falcon Reach. How long have we been going for? An hour and a couple minutes. Yeah, we'll head back to Falcon Reach. Whoops. <laughs> um, that was an accident. Uh, do what you can to ignore that, I suppose. I was real worried that because I accidentally clicked to book three, it was gonna warp me to book three's Falcon Reach. <laughs> and I would have been. I would have had to edit that out. <laughs> yeah, we'll go ahead and sell this real quick. Shop. Um, no, we don't want to sell. We'll sell our belt. I, I could have sworn I came across something else. I'll get rid of Okami's fire since we have one that's right in that ballpark. Actually, I'll get rid of the Crackled Light, too, since we have a weapon that is two levels higher than that. Or four levels higher than that. We're gonna be... There's gonna be some mean I told you so's in a minute, though. Like, I'm gonna go... I'm just gonna happen to go and fight the... Um... Fight like the water area that would be weak to energy or something. Alright, so I believe next time we will be tackling the Light Orb Saga. I don't really remember very much about the details of that one. I know it happens in the desert, but aside from that, I don't really know. So anyway, thank you for watching, and as always, follow me to Apex.